Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole. You can find me on Instagram at Nicole Makes Plans. Today I want to do a flip through of July in my planner, so let's hop in. Um, I began the month of July in this Philofax Original Ring Planner. Um, it's in the personal size. Um, I'm just going to kind of flip through how it was set up. So the first section I had was monthlies. I have this um, print out from or like insert from Plan With B for like the holidays. And then I had two monthlies. I had this one that I was crossing out as I went of just like keeping track of the days. This one is more of like my monthly log where I filled in um, information about what was happening each day in July, um, planning ahead. And I used the following months to like plan in the moment. I wasn't going to like save it to set up each month or anything like that. The second section is my weeklies. I got this vellum from Etsy. Um, this is just something I made. This is from Plan With B, and then more Filofax inserts. These are the ones that this actually came with. Um, and I had June in here still, but this is the first week of July. I used an extra plain notes page of Filofax inserts as like my weekly to-dos. I didn't have a day specific um, time to get it done, and all my day specific stuff was on the weekly insert itself. Um, you'll see my stickers, basically the star stickers was just like the day is done so I'm going to put a sticker down because I felt like it and then any of the butterfly stickers are like special events on that day or like highlights kind of. Um, more weekly to do's here. This is the second week of July. This is the third week of July and this is where I fell off out of this planner. I ran out of the plain inserts and I got new ones but like the paper quality was not the same at all so I think that didn't help. The rings is kind of like weird and awkward to me to write around so I think that didn't help but it was fun my time in here. Um, my third section is dailies. I have a vellum from Hobby Lobby. This was a card from Target that I cut down. This is an insert from Plan With B. And then more Filofax inserts. I got the two pages per day, although the weekends did not have two pages, which is also a little annoying to me. And I was using the plain inserts to supplement, but ran out of the good plain inserts. This was the first day of July, which was a Monday. We got Sands for dinner. It's a restaurant near us that has seafood. It's very good. Um, I'm trying to see if we watched a movie or anything. Oh, we watched Walking Dead and we got ice cream that day. This is the 2nd of July. Um, had BB Bop for dinner and Watched Walking Dead. The third day of July, which was a Wednesday, I was off of work before the holiday. I had breakfast at McDonald's. Um, I had a dentist appointment. I had to get cavities filled. I went to Winans, which is a local coffee place near us. We had Mexican for dinner at Uno Dos Tres. Um, we watched the movie Rocky and also Independence Day. This is the 4th of July. It was a Thursday. I was off of work. My husband was off of work. My friend was in town. We like went shopping. We went to a coffee shop again. We got, I think, ice cream twice on that day. More shopping. Um, and this was the day I got monetized on YouTube, which was kind of exciting. And this is July 5th, which was a Friday. I was off of work again, got more coffee at that coffee shop, shopping, met my husband for lunch. We had Olive Garden and a local Italian place pizza. We basically got like a salad from Olive Garden, pizza from a different place. And we watched ha um, House Bunny, the movie. Also went to a winery that day that was near us that I did not even know existed, and that was cool. 
We watched the movie Beekeeper as well. Saturday the 6th, we went to Winans again for coffee, um, had breakfast at McDonald's, um, went to a wings place for lunch, and a, like, I guess it's kind of a bar, but, like, it's kind of British-themed um, for dinner. We went to a pinball place, we went to um, mini golf and bowling, and we watched the movie Rush Hour. And then this is Sunday the 7th, we got coffee again. I hung out with my friend, we had brunch at a local place, we had hamburgers for dinner, went to the groceries. Um, got a boba tea, had a phone call with my sister that day. This is Monday, July 8th. I hung out with my friend again. We went to the pool. I was off of work. Um, we got sushi for lunch. We had Mexican for dinner with some of our friends. Um, I filmed a video that day and uploaded it. I was getting obsessed with uh, Chapel Roan. So I wrote in a song that I was listening to that day, got coffee, breakfast at McDonald's again. I go through phases where I'm like very obsessed with a certain food, so you'll see that. Um, Tuesday the 9th, I was back at work and we went to my friend's house for dinner, had um, Chick-fil-A for dinner, we played cards, and my husband got Digimon on DVD, so we watched an episode of that. On Wednesday the 10th, um, I had a work event, so I worked till 5.30, which is a little bit later than usual. On Thursday the 11th, work again, um, we went or got roosters for dinner, so we had chicken, had a video call with my sister. On July 12th, work again, I had a um, like presentation to give that day, we got pizza for dinner, we had tacos for lunch, and um, I had a video call with my sister. Watched Sex in the City that night. I had watched, um, like, most or the whole series, like, a few years ago, and I, like, watched some of my favorite parts that day. Um, and we watched the movie Spectacular Now. On Saturday the 13th, I went to my mom's for lunch and cards. Shopping or returns. Um, and then on... Oh, I think, I don't know. This, okay, so I use some of the inserts from the dated yearly inserts that I wasn't going to use. So like this was from February, I blacked it out and then I used it for like, so I would have two pages for Saturday, but I think it got weird or I need another page. I think this is Saturday the 13th again. We ended up watching Muriel's Wedding on Netflix and that was fun has Tony Collette and then this is Sunday the 14th filmed and uploaded a video got coffee at wine ends had lunch at the skyline Debella's for dinner which was sandwiches this is Monday the 15th and I think this is my last day in here it was my friend's birthday um, I had work that day we got seafood for dinner um, we got ice cream that day, and I planned out the 16th, and then I was not in here anymore. I just wanted something different, and so I set up this Hobanichi Weeks. Um, this is my July monthly here, and planning ahead in the months just so it was ready to go. I ended up back planning June just for fun. Um, and then in my weeks, so like this is the current week, last week, um, two weeks ago, and then I back planned as well. At least a little bit of June, maybe.
be a little bit of May and then I've stopped, but I might still do that. And then in the notes pages, I used it for dailies. And this is a Hobonichi Weeks regular, so it only has like 70 note pages. So I wasn't gonna get like a page per day, but I also wasn't really sure how long I would be in here anyway. So it's fine. Um, this is Tuesday, July 16th. I was off of work, I had a haircut. It was my first haircut in like a year and a half. I had cut my own hair since then, but I know I needed like a professional cut, so I'm glad I did that. Met my husband for lunch at a sushi place. We had Warped Wing for dinner. We saw a Lion King, it was back in theaters, and I was listening to Charlie XCX, um, her new album, Brat. And I've been listening to that on repeat quite a lot. This is Wednesday, July 17th. Um, went to my friend's house for dinner and cards. We had pizza, watched The Walking Dead that night, had ice cream as well. This is Thursday, July 18th. We had like a family event at work, so we were at that for a little bit. And then we saw Twisters in theater that night and we had BB Bop for dinner. On Friday, July 19th, had work, had Mexican for dinner, watched the movie 65 on Netflix. It has Adam Driver. It was interesting. It wasn't my favorite, but that's okay. It was something new. We, um, on Saturday, July 20th, we went to Cincinnati to meet my sister and my parents for dinner, and that was fun. I had a really good arepa for lunch that day. We watched the movie Reality Bites, which was on Netflix. It has Ethan Hawke and Winona Ryder and Ben Stiller. And I think Ben Stiller directed it. It was kind of weird, but I like the 90s vibes. Um, Sunday, July 21st is here. Um, my husband went to a NASCAR race that day, I think. I had lunch at Jimmy John's. I filmed an uploaded video. Um, I had City Barbecue for dinner did some shopping. Um, I watched the movie Anything But You, which came out at the end of last year, but I hadn't seen it yet and I loved it. Should have watched it sooner, should have watched it in theaters, but I didn't, so that's okay. It was on Netflix, so I got to catch up on that. Monday, July 22nd, I had a conference for work in um, a bigger city near us. We went to Skyline for dinner. My husband got a tattoo that day. Tuesday, July 23rd, it was the second day of that conference at, for work, and we ended up getting roosters for dinner. I got a postcard from my friend that day. Wednesday, July 24th, we had breakfast for dinner, and a package from my friend Diana arrived. She got me some stickers, and I'm figuring out a project to use those stickers on soon. I don't think I'm in a stickering mood for my current planning style at this time, um, but they were really cool stickers, so I do wanna use them. Um, Thursday, July 25th, um, I got, or we had meatloaf for dinner, had work that day, had a call with my sister. This is Friday, July 26th here. We had pizza for dinner, I had work that day. Um, another video call with my sister and the Olympics started and we watched some of the opening ceremony. I know it was like historical, but I kind of didn't get it. I wish the commentator would have like talked about the historical aspect a little bit more maybe. Um, Saturday, July 27th, I had work, which I don't work a lot of Saturdays, but we did that day. Filmed and uploaded a video, had Chinese for dinner and rewatched Anyone But You because I'm obsessed with it. And Sunday, July 28th, I went to my mom's house again for dinner and, er, lunch and cards. We had a place called The Great Greek. I didn't think it was that good, but I'm glad we tried something new. And um, went to Debella's for dinner to get sandwiches, watched some more Olympics, there was basketball on. On um, yesterday, it was Monday, July 29th, had McDonald's for dinner. We watched Deadpool in theaters. The third one, Deadpool and River Wolverine was out and it was fun. Um, watched a little bit of Olympics yesterday. There was like swimming and diving. And then today is 
Tuesday, July 30th. And that kind of ends, I think, my time in here, at least maybe for now. We'll kind of see how it goes this week. But I did set up an A6 Stology. So this is really for August for the most part. But I put in... Um, the last few days of July as well. So this is the index, this is the future log, this is the monthly log for August and a little bit of July, some monthly to-dos. This is this current week, this is yesterday, which is Monday, so I back-planned what I had put in my Hokonichi weeks um, that we saw Deadpool. Um, and today is July 30th. Um, I met my husband for sushi. I was off of work again. And I got coffee, did some returns, got some groceries, that kind of thing. So yeah, that is what July looked like in my planners. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment below if you have any questions about anything that I used or how I set anything up or if you want me to film um, any video ideas that you have. Comment below. Um, also, if you need any information about any, like where to get any of these planners or materials, subscribe to my channel if you like plan with me videos and flip throughs and hit the notification bell if you want to know the next time I post a video because it's not always on the same day. But thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys next time.